It's me, Gotta Laugh, from the Political Carnival blog, and here I am to recap the week in politics via Twitter. This episode of My Tweet Spot is brought to you by Bushco Torture Photos. Have precious memories you want documented forever? Try Abu Ghraib Photo Labs. They're quick, they're easy, and they'll censor in a blink of an eye at no extra charge. And now, back to our Daily Coast blogger, Cogro X, one-man Twitter show, already in progress. Dick Cheney tortured for votes, but Sotomayor eats rice, so let's cover that. We'll do a remote from Auschwitz with Newt Gingrich. Will conservative radio hosts need proof that rape is torture too, or will they take our word for it this time? So, how many bad apples did we miss this time? Next up on every news channel, the debate on raping prisoners. We'll be joined by bloggers and pundits arguing the pros and cons. Can someone interview Saddam for his views on the rape photos versus his rape rooms? Oh, right. They hanged him for that. Dang. Do you think Karl Rove has the math on whether Americans support raping Iraqi kids? Do you think Republicans think child rape works? Why won't the heroes who saved American lives with their child rape step forward for their medals? Remember, though, photos of the rapes at Abu Ghraib still exist but the CIA destroyed the video of the torture at Gitmo. Sunday TV folks, reminder to please think ahead about who will represent the intellectual core of the child rape party this weekend. Say it with flowers. Our thanks torturers bouquet includes organic bamboo shoots that look great under any fingernails. Will Cheney, either one, please do a White House press corps dinner comedy video about child rape next year so the press can yuck it up? And there you have it, all the torture snarkage anyone could ask for.